good. Oh no. I you hate it when that happens in the morning when your eyeliner or mascara just gets on your eyelids. <sighs> Frustrating. Good morning everybody. It is a very frosty Monday morning. Which you can't really see. It's very, very foggy out. I think it's the first frost of the season. But it was very chilly this morning. I was seeing Chris off. Oh dear. I was seeing Chris off this morning and I was like, whoa, it's really cold. Uh, so yeah, I'm laid up. About to head to the station to start my Monday. Dreading it slightly. I'm not anxious about it anymore. I don't think. I think I got it all out of my system for the most part. Um, but that doesn't mean I'm motivated particularly. I'm going to go. I will see you guys when I get to the station, hopefully. Holy crap, on a cracker is it breathing. Whew. It's one of those days where you see your breath. I don't know if you can see it on camera. <laughs> a little bit, I think. But yeah, look how ominous it looks over there. That's like where ghost trains come from. I've got to get on that ghost train. It is insanely chilly today. Today is definitely the first frost of the season, which is very exciting. It feels very Halloween-y now. I've had to pull out my gloves for the first time, so that's also pretty exciting. Oh, it is very cold. I know I'm gonna burn up walking from the station to my campus because I always do, but you know, it's nice that it's cold there that's gonna cool me down afterwards. We had to get up half an hour earlier today, so I didn't really get the full benefits of the clocks going back and getting an extra hour in bed because we had to get up earlier because Chris has to go back to his house to feed his cats because his parents are away. They come back today, so he won't have to do it tomorrow, which means we get, you know, a little bit more time in bed. <laughs> oh dear. It is cold. Like, really cold. So today is the module that makes me very stressed. And like I said earlier, I'm not feeling as stressed as I usually do today because I feel like I've found a stress-free solution. <laughs> Hopefully. Um, but we're not meeting as a group today, outside of us. We're meeting in a group, like, within our seminar, but last week I missed like our first group meeting without like outside of the seminar but only two people out of the five of us showed up anyway <sighs> typical student say <laughs> so yeah we're gonna have a meeting in the seminar today I'm talking about what we're gonna do and how we're gonna do it all so I feel glad now that I've kind of got that out of the way I feel a lot less stressed <sighs> although Monday is still pretty <laughs> miserable because there is still some stress it's not completely gone away but also it's just the longest day it's just there's such a big gap between my lecture and my seminar that i'm just there all day sucks crappy put the camera down now because i've not really got much else to say but it's uh in summary it's it's really cold <laughs> I can't feel my fingers through my gloves. It's that kind of cold. It was like one degree last night. Aunt Snow. <laughs> you can't even see me. Hello. Made it to London. It is still freezing. That's the update. Really cold. On a Monday I get in super early for the sake of getting a lift to the station in the morning. So I can take my time getting there and then I can sit in the nice warm library for like an hour until my uh, lecture at 11, which I think what time is it now? Oh, exposing my arm. It's cold. I can't even put my watch. Exactly half nine. So I'm going to get to the campus by about 9.45 and yeah, half pretty much an hour until I, I have to get up again for my lecture. It's just gonna be jumping from one warm building to another. Oh, I bet my lecture was gonna be so cold though. It's a chapel, like a converted chapel. Ew, it's gonna be so cold. <sighs> pretty, frosty, <They're> pretty. <laughs> Isn't it a pretty view? So yeah.
I just had this grossest sandwich for lunch and I'm really sad about it. Oh dear, my bag's falling apart, hang on. First of all, when I arrived, there were no sandwiches. How sad. And then after that, they, they didn't have any other sandwiches I wanted, so I picked one, thinking it would be really nice. And it had like gherkins and tomatoes in it. It was really bad. Had a bad day. <laughs> Anyway, I'm going over to the library now to do some work on my group project because we're not meeting as a group today. Uh, but I really want to get some stuff done for it for the seminar because we'll be meeting as a group in the seminar. So, <clears throat> I'm gonna go get that done. So I'll see you whenever I see you. Quite a lot later, probably. Well, one is the 17th of Southwest Oh, my phone is ringing. Is it Queenstown Road? Oh, no. Vauxhall and Hello. Hello. So I was rudely interrupted. Oh, and yeah, so I didn't talk to you. So I would have caught up with you in the library, but there were like so many people there and I had to share a desk with someone, which I never have to do. So I felt weird pulling my camera out. Then I went straight to my seminar. I ended up having to leave slightly early because if I left any later I would have missed the train. <laughs> so I left, I stayed as long as I could and then I left and yeah I was gonna catch up with you at the station and point out how dark it was but um I couldn't but I can now kind of point out we're in a car park right now. Can you see outside from there? That, that's outside, that semicircle. It's pitch black. It's uh 620. Blazer. N no. Oh. What's well, 620? Post blazer. Blazing it 50% harder. Why 50%? Because if you added 50% onto 4, it'd be 6. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna go now. Chris's parents have come back, so he's gonna drop me off at my house and he's gonna go say hi to his parents. And then he's gonna come back to me, we're gonna have dinner. Right? Yeah. Cool. I'll turn the lights off now. You can go. <laughs> look how scary I look. Although I do look better because you can't see my spot in the dark. Haha. -ha. <laughs> Hiding. Classic. Let me in. Whatever. Are you mad at me so I let you have my tiffin? No. My sister made tiffins. And Chris wants my piece. It's so good. <laughs> I'm gonna end the vlog here because I'm because super Because George is gonna go downstairs and get me some more tiffin. No. Because I'm super duper tired and I want to edit this video. Is that before or after you get me some tiffin? <laughs> Not getting you tiffin. Stop laughing! I'm on your belly! Do you know what my belly doesn't have enough of? <laughs> <laughs> You're stupid. Anyways, we're gonna end the vlog here. <laughs> Say bye! Bye! Can you have me for my piece? I said, what about breakfast at Tiffin? <laughs>